All right, lower body combination paired set. I like to use this as a finisher with the NT loop. I'm gonna use both the NT loops. You could just use a single NT loop. I'm gonna be using a stability ball to elevate my shoulders. You could use a bench or a couch, and you could also use the floor. Show you both the exercises, and then we'll go to the details. We got hip thrust, we got squats. Now, just using that stability ball to elevate my shoulders, we'll talk about the setup and details all in a bit. Here's the NT loop hip thrust. So because we're gonna use this as a finisher, we're going for a high rep, so we're gonna go as many reps as you can do, up to 50, all right? Chin stays looking down towards the floor, hips up as high as I can without pushing the belly out. We wanna get extension from the glutes without extension from the back. So if the belly's pushing out, you're not getting the movement where we want it from. All right, so when I'm done there, again, by the way, if I wanna get rid of the ball, no problem, you just, if you don't have the ball, just do these from the floor. You want to be wide enough with your feet, pushing your knees out the whole time, that you're really getting your glutes working. When you're done, just take them off there. Then, the other part of this superset finisher is anti loop squats. So you're going to step with the band towards the back of your feet, fairly wide without getting like a sumo stance. Bring your torso down to the band. From here, grab about your knee height, pull the band up, and then there are your squats. The reason why I have the band slightly positioned behind the center of my feet is so my knees get to push against the band. If the band is further up here, this is gonna happen the whole time. You don't want that, right? You don't want the band flip flop between your knees, in front of your knees. And again, you'll do as few as 10 all the way up to 50, whatever you can do there. Another way to extend that set, let's say you can only do 20 with the NT loop, but you want to add a little bit more work, take the NT loop away, finish with just body weight squats. You could do those in either order. I prefer to do the hip thrust, NT loop hip thrust, then the NT loop squats. Now, a couple details on setting up those hip thrusts. Whether you're going to use a stability ball to elevate your shoulders, or a bench. Here's what the setup looks like. Let's use the red because it's going to be a little easier to see. It's a brighter color. So simply put the label in the center and hold the loops like that, right? Put them down on the floor and I'm just going to put my feet in those two stirrups, center of my feet. Now, you want to have your knees bent the whole time because otherwise if your legs are straight, you can't pull the band over your knees, it'll just flop right off. But you wanna be able to walk yourself down. Here's a solution I came up to for this one day, just working out at home by myself. Grab one side, pull it over your knee, like that, and then hold it with your opposite hand. Then all of a sudden I can do is I can just get myself situated where I need. Then all I do is I want this knee inside, so I just pull it over that side. So there we have it. So I'm gonna to turn to you a little bit more so you can see. See that setup? And then there's my hip thrust. All right, so when I'm done, I can do one of two things. I can just pop it off all the way, or if I want to hold it, just get rid of it that way. So now it's on one, and then I can come back, and we're good to go. So if you don't have a stability ball, or not a bench, you want to use the floor, it's the same setup. Look, just hold it out like this. Here, put this down like this, if you don't, don't, don't need to get your feet all in up top like this. Look, just let it go down. It opens up the holes. Put your feet in the stirrups. Knees have to be bent because you want to pull this over your knees and you want it just below your knees. And then from there, there's your hip thrust. Pushing your knees out as you push your hips up. 